he could have tried to force a shot there. Instead, LeBron keeps his eyes up, finds an open teammate. Yeah, that's a good way to start the game. Nice inside bucket right there. Back to LeBron. Goes up the baseline. One way with some nice D. Shut down. This is the way you play defense. This is how you protect the rim. Great positioning on the footman. Oh, a nice tip in to salvage the points from that missed shot. And those second chance points in and up. Ducks aren't always for the big foul. A serious power move from the point. Forget just landed in. He wanted to make a statement. Curry can't get it to go. Wow, that's one you just kind of assume is going in. Tough luck. And it's Williamson missing. A little over a minute 30 in this first quarter. Kept alive. Pass to Curry. Here's LeBron. And he gets the whistle for the three-second call. And Zach Levine gets the whistle that time. That is his first foul of the game. James right side. Finished off by LeBron. Powerful high flyer. LeBron attacks the rim like no one else. Outside Kirk. Outside Levine. Here's Plumley. That's good. And it's Levine with the assist. Plumley's got his second buck. Beautiful find by Levine there. Takes his time to survey the floor. Oh, no one around him. Here's Williamson. Offensive rebound. Another miss. Boy, they had their chance there, but couldn't get it to go. Outside Levine. The rebound by Hart. Picks him up defensively. And Zach Levine gets the whistle that time. That'll be his second foul of the game. The question is, do you leave him in? Obviously, you don't want him to pick up a third foul this early. And so it's going to be a three-second violation out there on the defense. And the technical free throw is good. What you respect about Zion, he's not trying to flex on everyone. He sees the big picture on the court and in the public eye. Well, what did Coach tell us? We wanted each guy to contest shots and rebound tonight. That's exactly what we just saw. And we're approaching about three and a half minutes played in the first quarter. The layup, layup off target. You know what, though? They keep calling his number despite the difficult quarter he's had. Curry shot his off. Offensively, that's how you want to end the possession, except for the result. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. And to think LeBron in high school was recruited by some D1 colleges to play wide receiver. Boy, what a downfield target he would have been. Here we go, one on one. Oh, he gets the bucket. Well, that's why they're in front. A great 
aggressive play at both ends. Nicely done. 102 left to play here in the first. Curry fires from way outside. Plumley. That was a good point. Great tee that time from O'Brien. And already they just take out a noticeable advantage in terms of aggression and controlling the back of the Let the little guy get airborne before you slide over to block him out. He can and will embarrass you on the board. Cut that one. He's relentless at finding ways to produce. LeBron this time converting off the miss. And that's going to be a turnover. They call him for eight seconds. They need to start taking care of the basketball. Careless play since the opening game. And the jump by Williamson. The defense can't stop a force like Zion. Once he's airborne, the slam is almost inevitable. I saw Levine. And nothing is calling for him right now. And that concludes the first four. Again, for tuning in. If you're just joining us, we've played through one quarter of action so far. Guys, what's your take on the home team so far? Way to set the table. Offensively, they dominated on the interior. They came in looking to attack from the get-go, willing to be physical and setting the tone. Catch up with our sideline reporter, David Alton. Hey, Kevin, good to hear from you. Now, Zach Levine has become a star, but he knows there's still work to be done. He said, I'm stepping into a leadership role, asking more of myself and giving more each year. You've got to look at your faults. I have to continue to improve my defense. I want to help us make the playoffs. I accept as a player is winning. Guys, back to you. Great attitude, Dave. Thank you. And oh, here we go. Willard's got the best red chance. Goes up. And Tillian Willard throws it down home. And arguably no one in the NBA draws more attention than Hart. That he creates so many opportunities for others. Shot you were looking for, but it's a fairly clean look 
almost have to take it. Here's Levine. Fires from the wing. And misses it off the right side of the rim. Williams. And that's a foul. Called on Dwight Powell. That's his first foul. And he drew that call by establishing his base early and then doing a great job with the box out. Beautiful to the eyes. That's good fundamental basketball. You love to see that playing the right way. And so he hits the technical free throw. So many different aspects to Curry's game. You know, we've talked about his ability to get to the free throw line. Watching the line there, that'll be a backcourt violation. And when you're trying to cut into a lead, you can ill afford mistakes like that. You know what it is, a lack of concentration. That's a momentum killer. And there's the call on Curry. That's his first foul. About three minutes played so far in the second quarter. And Steph Curry with the foul. That's foul number two for him. His second foul in as many quarters. We'll see if he backs off or stays aggressive. Offensive rebound. Just doesn't seem to have it here in the second quarter. I see from Levine. The shot's good from Plumley. Plumley's got six. And that's his strong suit, the ability to find his way through the D and finish at the rim. Here's Cole. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. They get Stephen Curry. This is his first free throw of the game. He's off on the first. Probably a little draft in the arena tonight. He's the last guy you expect to miss the mark by that much. And a little under three and a half minutes elapsed in the second quarter of play. Tate puts the move on. This is what you love about AD. Combines the skill with the great physical attributes. Excellent pump fake. It's his first trip to the line. And he can't get the first one. And he's good on the second. The future is bright for Anthony Davis. Not only is he a scorer, he's efficient, he's effective, and he's passionate about the game. And that's his fourth foul. And we're not even at halftime. That is going to limit his playing time and his aggressiveness the rest of the game. Two shots. And both free throws good for Damian Lillard. He's living there tonight, a tough guy to guard without fouling. And the bonus, he's going to knock him down. High post, Davis. Kicks it out to LeBron. 